Jesus, in his earthly ministry, demonstrated boundless compassion and power by healing many from the blind to the lepers, showcasing that with faith, miraculous healing is within reach. The healing examples in the Bible are powerful examples for us today, assuring us that we too can experience such profound healing and restoration through our unwavering faith in God as our Jehovah Rapha, our Lord who heals. If you believe that God can make a difference in your life today, let us stand together in faith. I will pray a powerful prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. My friends, in the journey of life, we often encounter moments of physical, emotional, or spiritual challenges. It's in these times that we need to embrace the profound truth that the act of prayer is not just a ritual, but a profound source of comfort, strength, and deliverance. In the book of James, chapter 5, verses 14 to 15, it is written, Is anyone among you sick? Let him call for the elders of the church, and let them pray over him, anointing him with oil in the name of the Lord. And the prayer of faith will save the sick, and the Lord will raise him up. These words remind us of the profound connection between faith, prayer, and healing. Prayer for healing is not just about asking for physical cure, but seeking a holistic restoration of the body, mind, and spirit. It's a journey towards wholeness, where we open our hearts to God's mercy and love, trusting in His plan for our well-being. God wants you healed. And another great news is that nothing is impossible with God. Absolutely nothing. As we turn to God in prayer, we acknowledge our own limitations and the uncertainty of our human condition. We recognize that true healing often requires more than just physical remedies. It requires the peace and comfort that can only come from our Heavenly Father. And this act of prayer we are not just petitioners, but participants in a divine exchange. We offer our worries, our pain, and our hopes to God, and in return, we receive His grace and comfort. This exchange is a testament to the relationship God desires to have with each of us, a relationship marked by trust, love, and compassion. As we prepare our hearts to pray, let us remember that our prayers do not fall on deaf ears. God's love and presence surrounds us, and His power is at work within us. Our prayers for healing are a testament to our faith in a God who not only hears but responds. Let us also be mindful that healing can take many forms. Sometimes it's instant and miraculous. At other times, it's a gradual process that involves patience and persistence in faith. Regardless of the form it takes, the act of praying for healing is a powerful affirmation of our belief in a God who cares, who heals, and who restores. My friends, as we pray, let us do so with open hearts, ready to receive God's grace in whatever form it comes. Let our prayer for healing be a bridge that connects our earthly struggles with the divine promise of comfort, strength, and restoration. Let us pray with faith, with hope, and with an unwavering trust in the God who heals. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. You may also listen to this prayer daily as you build your faith and come in agreement. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, I come before you with a heart full of praise. You are the Almighty, 
the creator of heaven and earth, the source of all life and healing. Your majesty and power are unmatched, and your love knows no bounds. Lord, you are Jehovah Rapha, my healer and restorer, who mends the broken and revitalizes the weary with your boundless compassion and power in your hands. What is frail becomes strong, and what is broken finds wholeness. I put my faith in your unending ability to heal both body and soul. I glorify your name, Lord, for you are worthy of all honor and adoration. Your works are wonderful, and I am continually in awe of the miracles you perform in our lives. Thank you, Lord, for the countless blessings you have showered upon me and my loved ones. Your grace and mercy are my daily sustenance, and I am grateful for your unfailing love and care. Forgive me, Father, for my shortcomings and transgressions. As I seek your forgiveness, I also extend forgiveness to those who have wronged me, following your example of unconditional love and grace. Lord, deliver me from all evil and from all the powers of darkness. Deliver me from all accidents and negative incidents. Lead me away from temptation and guide my steps towards righteousness and wisdom so that I may walk in your ways and live a life that honors you and reflects your love and truth. Lord, you are Jehovah Rapha, my healer. I pray for your healing touch upon every part of my being. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke every sickness, disease, disorders, pain, or discomfort in my body. I declare complete healing and restoration in every cell, every organ, every marrow and tissue, every bone and joint, and every system. Let your healing power flow through me, restoring vitality and health. Jehovah Rapha, I pray for your healing touch on my mind. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke depression, stress, anxiety, worry, addiction, and every mental struggle. Fill me with your peace that surpasses all understanding, and let joy be my strength. Lord, surround me with your peace that surpasses all understanding, and renew my mind with your hope and strength. In the name of Jesus, I break the chains of these afflictions, replacing fear with faith, despair with hope, and addiction with freedom. In your mercy, restore my mental health and guide me along paths of recovery and resilience. I also pray for emotional healing. Lord, heal my heart from past hurts and deliver me from any connecting anxiety or fear that tries to take hold. God of wisdom, guide me in making wise decisions regarding my health and well-being. If the need arises, may you lead me to the right medical professionals and give me discernment in choosing treatments and remedies. I trust in your guidance, knowing that you always lead me on the path of righteousness for your name's sake. In your mercy, Lord, extend your protection over me. Guard me against any attack of the enemy. In the name of Jesus, I bind every plan of the enemy, meant to harm me, physically, emotionally, or spiritually. Surround me with your hedge of protection, keeping me safe from all dangers. Lord, as I say this prayer, together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is humbled before you right now. We come in agreement, claiming victory over every challenge we face. In the name of Jesus, we declare healing 
and restoration over every part of our being, in our relationships, and in every area of our lives. We pray for our loved ones, Lord. Bless them as you have blessed us. Let your healing, protection, and guidance be upon them. May they experience your love and mercy in every aspect of their lives. Thank you, Lord, for your Holy Spirit, who guides and comforts us. Help us to be sensitive to his leading, that we may walk in obedience to your will. Thank you, Lord, for healing us in all the places that we need your healing touch. We praise you, God, for your ceaseless miracles of healing, reflecting your deep love and care for each of us. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray, amen. If you were blessed by this prayer, type the word amen in the comments section below. I declare that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you. In the mighty name of Jesus, you can help us to reach more persons and spread the gospel. You can do this by sharing the video with a friend or family member and by clicking the like button. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel Daily Jesus Prayers for more videos that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. We appreciate all your support. You're blessed to be a blessing. Please, feel free to leave your prayer request in the comments section so that we can present them before God for your blessings and victory and so that other believers on the YouTube platform and all over the world can join us and start praying for you right now. Stand in faith with us while we pray. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.